What if I told you you could have a full chassis that weighs 26 ounces? You'd call me crazy. Well, today we're going to go over just that, the MDT HNT 26. Let's check it out. At SHOT Show 2022, we were able to swing by the MDT booth and I saw something sitting on the wall that seemed rather interesting, um, a carbon fiber chassis. And I was like, man, I bet that thing's light. So I wait for a couple people to, you know, clear the way. I pull it off and I'm like, oh my goodness. This is the lightest, maybe stock I've ever held, let alone a chassis. 26 ounces in the standard configuration. That is insane. So how do they do it? Well, MDT has figured out how to do almost everything in carbon fiber besides the middle chassis where the action sits. Now, obviously that has to be aluminum as your action has to have something super solid to lock into. But other than that, almost the whole chassis is carbon fiber. The handguard, the grip, most of the stock, I mean, 26 ounces in a full chassis. So let's go over some of the features that the h and 26 has. Now there are a couple different options for this chassis. You can get with or without the folding mechanism, and you can also get it with or without the integrated arca rail. So the particular one I have here has the folding stock mechanism and the standard non-arca rail. So starting at the back, it has an adjustable length of pull with included spacers, QD cups integrated into the carbon fiber stock, and then it also has an adjustable cheek piece or comb. So you can grab the correct tool, you know, adjust your comb to the correct height for where you want it. Moving a little bit more forward, like I said, this one has the folding stock adapter. So you can see in the folded position, it goes to the left. And then if you push the button, you can close it. It's honestly a very solid folding mechanism, so I really like that. Moving forward from there, you'll see the pistol grip is hollow. It is carbon fiber. I'm sure it weighs absolutely nothing. You have the aluminum chassis, and on the bottom of the trigger guard, you'll notice that it is milled out to cut weight. You have your magazine release here, and this chassis does take the AICS pattern magazines. So that is very nice because it's universal and there's a lot of options out there. Moving forward, the carbon fiber forend, which this comes as, you know, two pieces in the box. So you have to put this together. And I'm telling you, this forend weighs ounces. It is crazy how lightweight this forend is. On the handguard itself, there are M-lock on the sides, top and bottom. So if you need to add rails or anything that you want to, you can and then there are two QD cups, one on the left and one on the right. Now I'm not able to actually, you know, test this chassis, um, but just by handling it, you can tell that it's not cheap. So this chassis comes in around $1,600 retail, exactly how this one sits. Uh, this has the folding adapter and no Arca. So if you get rid of the folding mechanism, it's gonna be a little bit less expensive. Um, if you get the Arca, then it's going to be a little bit more expensive. So you have some options to play around with. So do I think it's worth the $1,600? Well, if you've got $1,600, heck yeah. Um, if you're trying to build a lightweight rifle, you're not going to find something, especially in a chassis that's really even close to this. Most chassis sit four pounds plus. So just in weight on the chassis, you're shaving over two pounds right off the bat. Um, if you have a heavy chassis, you're gonna shave more than that. So if you're looking for something that you can have, you know, one rifle, you wanna shoot PRS matches, uh, you wanna shoot long range, but then you also wanna be able to hunt with it. Well, if, if budget is not really something you're worried about, this chassis would be the perfect host. Um, having, you know, a carbon fiber barrel, an action, a lighter weight scope, toss it in this, I mean, you're sub 10 pounds on a rifle that can be capable of shooting at very large distances. You know, having the adjustable cheek piece, adjustable length of pole, the aluminum uh, chassis itself is gonna make it very accurate 
very modular and very, very lightweight. So yeah, I think it is a good option. Again, it is $1,600. It's a lot more expensive than most stocks or chassis. But if you find a carbon fiber stock, it's probably gonna be around the same weight and you're gonna get less options. If you get a carbon fiber stock with an adjustable cheek piece and a folding mechanism, you're gonna be a lot heavier than this. Um, so that's where I really think this shines. So as we see more h and 26 chassis out there, I'll be very interested to see how accurate these rifles are. We know they're lightweight and we know MDT has a very good track record. So I think they're gonna be awesome. Uh, if you guys have any questions or comments, leave those below. I will post links uh, to some of the chassis that we have on our website. As always, make sure to hit that subscribe button as we have some awesome content to come and check us out at MidwestGunWorks.com.